Hey everybody, good morning. Welcome back to Subsistence 62. Nice day, man. Third day. And you know what? Before I head out, there's something I want to do here. I gotta I gotta move this around. There's some rocks around here. I wanna see if I'm gonna have good clearage when it comes to some of these rocks. Cause I don't want to have rocks inside my base. And that so far is looking okay. I'm getting close to being able to put the BCU down. And I don't think that that'll be inside the base. That's that's good news. I think... Um, Alright. Alright. I think we can uh, work with this. Okay, I think I'm going to move this fire here. I want to put the BCU back here a little bit. Okay. Uh, wolf is gonna be able to run up there, Steve. If a wolf is, if a wolf is changing us, chasing us, he's gonna be able to come right up here, and then it's gonna be chaos. <laughs> yeah, go. Whatever. Okay, we're moving this again. This is a good spot. If I'm getting chased by a wolf or a bear, um, they're not gonna be able to get me up here. I'll, I should be safe. Okay, let's put that there. Let's get a wall up here and a BCU. And as I mentioned in the first video, in case you didn't see that one, I have hunters disabled right now. I'm not gonna have them in the game. Not for a little while at least. Let's get a little more fuel. I wanna keep that going, at least for a little bit. And, okay. Now, need the BCU. Excellent. Put you up here. Okay, watch out for the fire. Uh, do you want to sit in the middle or over to the right? There we go. That looks good. Let's grab our free key. Uh, fire's there. All right. All right. We are ready to go. We're ready to go for the day. Let's get out there. Um, my plan is to head back to the center pond. We did not finish clearing out that area. I'm gonna grab this here, that looks good. Um, okay, I was kind of wondering if maybe the trees were a part of the um, three day kind of reset thing, or if you can always get, um, you know, wood off of the tree every day. And it looks like you can, which is good. All right, I think I got everything. <laughs> All right, that's like going around and around is making me dizzy. Okay, I'll stop recording that for you poor people who are watching this. It's like, ah, oh, you're spinning around and around to get all the fiber. You're making me dizzy, giving me headaches. Okay, we won't do that anymore. Okay, no more shots of me spinning around in fiber. At least not now. I do wonder if the three-day restriction is going to impact the, uh, the bags and the crates that we find with all the loot. I wonder if that's going to be a part of the issue we're going to have to uh, deal with. I mean, we'll, we'll find out here. The plan will be eventually once I feel like I'm getting really well set up to pick an area, clear it out, and then go back and kind of take a look at it the next day and see if, you know, what we can and can't get. And right now we know we can definitely get more wood from the trees, but we don't know if bags and stuff will respawn. And, um... I would think that maybe ore is also going to be a part of this issue. Maybe um, once you clear out ore, it's going to take three days for it to reset in that area. Perhaps, maybe, I don't know. Okay, here we go. Take my apple. Excellent. I wonder if the fact that I have hunters turned off, if that will impact whether we get airplane flyovers. Because I didn't read anything in the notes that would suggest that you need uh, hunters turned on to still get airplanes. I mean, we'll find out. I don't know how long it's going to take for us to finally uh, get our first flyover. Hopefully, hopefully it just flies over. I don't want to have to. I don't want to feel tempted to go out there and get it because we are so totally not ready to um, go out and fight for it. But. Man, if I hear an airplane and it crashes and I can find it. Ooh, 
man, I, I want to go get it, too. Okay, let's get this pickaxe going, man. We are definitely going to need that. Oh, that's not... <laughs> Damn it, everything looks like fiber or freaking medicinal herbs for me, man. This is so cruel. This game is just so cruel. I'm running by plant fibers. I'm not I'm not taking the resist. I'm making sure to do the right thing. Plant fibers. We're just gonna run right by it. Cause it's more important more important to be eaten by a wolf. Ooh, I see a carrot over there. Any bets whether it's a carrot or a carrot seed? Oh, hold on the fibers. Hold on the fiber, Steve. Oh, I just picked up carrots. Oh, I'm I'm love I'm loving these changes, man. I'm loving it. Really truly am. Okay, take it easy, Steve. Just go slowly. Don't give everyone a migraine headache spinning around. Okay, we're good. We're good. Um, is that, is that, could that be? Okay. There we go. We got it. We're good. Doing a good job. Just slow down. Everyone's going to be okay. Come on. I need another shotgun shell. Yeah. I think those bags, like these bags should have like a guaranteed, like one kind of bullet maybe in there and not just, oh, there's some, you know, gunpowder and stuff like I would I would like to see the developer change it so you like guarantee to get like an ammunition item just a bullet or a shotgun shell something like that guaranteed to be in there so it's not just the parts for making you know said ammunition well couple bunnies and then I'll be able to make a a shotgun. I would like to do that. Definitely like to do that. Okay, let me take a quick look here. All right, let's get down in there. Let's open that little bit up if we can. Oh, I see a crate here. What's in the box? All right, not bad. Not bad. Okay, yep, yep. You can go ahead. That foliage is all yours. Okay, I think we're good. Okay, no bear. Just one bear and a wolf. He doesn't know I'm here. Okay. That's fine. We're good. See you later, buddy. Okay, just a wolf over there, I think. Okay, how we doing on that? I'll grab that. Let's get a little something to drink. Okay, what we do have? We do have the uh, the grub in there, but I'm not gonna freaking eat a grub. That's for certain. Got to finish opening up this area, and then we'll head over to another area. Maybe not today. Maybe tomorrow. Try to open up as much of the map as we can. Yep, third day in the game, and it's definitely going to rain today. Definitely guaranteed, man. First two days are usually pretty decent weather. And then the third day, you're going to get a storm. It's the first storm that you're going to get. All right, we're okay. Wolf is over there. What have I got here? Let's take a look at this. Do I need... Okay, there's... That's... There's sandstone. There's a little bit of kelp. Yeah, let's grab it. Why the heck not? I don't see any clams here. Looking kind of not a lot here. All right. A little more kelp. Not bad. Okay, I see a bunny here. Come on, bunny. Pretty sure there was a bunny here. No, that's just a bag. Okay, not bad. Cotton, nice. I'll definitely, definitely take the cotton. Nice. 
Oh, look at all that fiber. Oh, so much fiber. I'm in fiber heaven. Holy cow! It's everywhere. There's a lot of changes with my new computer that I'm going to have to work out. Like, uh, when I try to take a screenshot with my keyboard, you know, just print screen as like a pop-up modal that I could pick to, you know, like, um, make, decide what part of the screen I want to, you know, take as my screenshot. And it's like, all I wanted to do is just take, just take a screenshot and then I can, uh, get it off my you know my downloads and everything folder it's gonna it's definitely gonna take some time to figure out this new computer but so far it seems pretty good i mean you know how that goes it's always a pain the first couple of uh weeks or so where you're trying to get everything set up the way you like it and as for my other series um I think that when it comes to, well, seven days to die, my, I can't get my files on the cloud, so I'm not going to be able to play that on this game until, I'm going to wait until we're done with the Darkness Falls series before I start playing games on seven days to die on this computer, because I just can't access what I have already saved, so that's fine. I mean... Here, I was able to save everything to the cloud for subsistence. And I think, was I able to do that with Ark or not? You know what? I can't remember. Ooh. That daze seems like it's moving pretty fast. Um, but yeah, I think, again, uh, like the new Ark series, once we, um, that's going to become a part of my day. Uh, video series so I'll have like subsistence one day and then arc the next and back and forth between those two and then the evening streams will probably be like um, seven days to die I think that's how that will be worked out and I think I know what I'm going to do for seven days to die next but I'm not going to share it with you yet I'll let you like know the day that we're doing maybe I'll leave a post and then you guys can like um, decide to play along if you want to it's it's a mod it's a little bit of a I don't know if it's considered an overhaul mod but it's um, looks very interesting this looks a little bit different and I'm definitely definitely looking forward to trying and playing it well it's getting dark let's just pass everything up I haven't even come close to getting all the plant fiber down here but I want that with the bunny go. I want to make a shotgun, man. I want to. I want if if not today, definitely first thing tomorrow. I want to have that ready, just in case we get an early plane. Yeah. You know what? You do need plant fiber. I mean, I need some protein. It's okay. It's okay. We got this. We got this. Don't worry. We got this. Don't worry. We got it. We got it. We're good. We're good. I know what I'm doing. I'm fly. I'm totally hooked up. I'm I'm, I'm jacked in. That bear's not going to get us. It, he could get me if I go up there. I'm pretty sure he'd get me if I go up there. Ooh, bunny. I don't think the bear's following us anymore. Yeah, he stopped. All right, shotgun. We can do this. Excellent. Let's get that. Oop. Okay, we'll do the shotgun thing tomorrow. How about, it's getting dark. Let's just get back to the base. So anyway, I think that'll be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I am enjoying myself. I think the developer did a good job. I think he listened to people's complaints about um, 
the changes that are coming out in beta and I think he has done the right things to make it uh to make it all good again so again usually I don't plug it like this a game like this so much but um, I think it's worthwhile picking it up again and starting to play it with some of the changes he made before he released this live and I'll see you guys in the next video okay later dudes